Now this is just one of the posters that councils across the UK have been using. We're not going to show you the part that actually pictures some real dog mess you'll be thankful to hear. It's potentially offensive, some find it shocking, but councils say that's the exact point. They want their message to come across loud and clear. It shows a young girl in a park, face and hands covered in chocolate, and below, some dog mess. We've obscured that, though. So, what do dog walkers make of it? I think it's really important to point out that children, it's not good for children with um, dog poo all over the place. And it's great to make sure dog owners pick it up and be responsible. I think a lot of them need to be put up. Hundreds. Hundreds. Thousands. Especially where we live and, and parks that we've been to. It's a constant battle for councils that are always looking for new ways to shame or shock those who flout the law. We want people to get the message and take notice that dog fouling is unacceptable, it is unlawful and it is a hazard and a risk to people's health and well-being and safety in the community, particularly young children. So we really want to get that hard-hitting message across through images like this. Angering some, but impressing others, the poster was created by Ron the Cunnan Taff Council. It hopes other authorities will follow its lead. John Maguire, BBC News.